Veteran stuntman Spanky Spangler works frequently in films and daredevil exhibitions. But Spanky's many stunts are just a prelude to Firebird Lake, where he hopes to set a new world record car jump. Spanky hopes to break the existing record of 204 feet by driving his car off this ramp at 80 miles per hour. He'll land in 17 feet of water marked by buoys. His wife, Candy, watches nervously from the stands. Cameras both inside and outside the car record the jump while across the lake, a rescue team of 15 waits. The impact caves in the car's windshield and damages its emergency oxygen system. As the car sinks, it traps Spangler inside without an air supply. The rescuers begin a series of dives in the murky water, but they can't locate Spanky. The car has landed upside down and is partially crushed. Debris from the wreck floats to the surface, but after three minutes, there is no sign of Spanky Spangler. Finally, the rescue team appears. Spanky is dazed but alive, and no one is more relieved than Candy Spangler. Spanky cleared 225 feet on his jump. A new world record.